How's it going Instacart shoppers? Today we're finally going to be showing you that proof that I have that Instacart is scamming the shoppers. I finally found an order that is a perfect example of what is going on and uh, we're going to break it all down for you guys but first ugh, gotta ask my dog what she thinks about this. What? Hey, how do you how do you feel about Instacart potentially scamming us shoppers? The mic's right there. Don't worry. Don't be shy. Please don't bite me. <laughs> I don't know how to take this cookie. What does this mean? Is this bad or good? Okay, get on. <laughs> okay, now that I got bit a thousand times, let's uh, take a look at this actual batch. All right, guys, here is the order that I think is pretty alarming, if I'm being honest. I'm gonna try to explain this the best as possible, but just a quick warning, I suck at explaining things for some reason, and we're just gonna try our best. We have a diagram here, so hopefully it's gonna be hard to mess this up. So this is how Instacart pay works. You have the batch pay and then the tip. That is how we get paid. So the tip, obviously we get 100% of that. There was some drama in the past with Instacart stealing tips, but we should be in the clear of that now. We're not even gonna worry about it. We're just gonna assume that we're getting 100% of the tip. So with that being said, this order was 1436 for 11.1 .1 miles and has heavy pay, which is a big reason why this order is so messed up. So once you subtract the tip from the total, you're left with $9.81. That is what Instacart paid us. Now, usually the minimum that they will pay you is $7. And how they get your batch pay is right here. You have miles, heavy pay, and then batch incentive. So keep in mind, we're only working from 981. That is how much Instacart paid us. And somehow we have to fit all three of these categories in there to somehow figure out how they're paying us. So the miles is a pretty easy one. Right here, it shows us that we get paid 60 cents per mile. And this is pretty standard. Unless if you live in like California, this is the basic number that you have. So with that being said, Instacart paid us $6.66 and miles alone. So whenever you guys subtract the $6 and change from the 981, you guys are left with $3.15 and that has to go into heavy pay because this order has heavy pay. Now let me show you why this is so alarming. So as you guys can see right here, the minimum pay for heavy pay is $5. And this is straight from an Instacart support agent. And with all the research that I've done, it seems like they used to pay smaller amounts for heavy pay, but lately it's just $5 minimum. And that is exactly what this agent said. The problem we have here is Instacart only paid us $3.15 for heavy pay, and there was literally $0 of batch incentive. Now batch incentive is how they get people to take those small orders. Just for example, pretend you see a $7 order. It's like three items. It's some soda, some chips and things like that. They're a mile away. Obviously one mile is only 60 cents and they have to reach a minimum of $7. So that's where they throw in this batch incentive to get it to the minimum of $7. Now this order specifically has $0 of batch incentive. The heavy pay is $1.85 short, and then they only basically paid us for the miles correctly. I think this is proof, guys. I don't think there's too much to argue about this. I think it is pretty cut and dry, and Instacart is screwing this up. I've seen countless orders like this, and I have done a lot of orders like this where I've seen similar things happen. There's zero transparency on how Instacart actually pays us in the base pay. They do show us the customer tip, which is easy to do, but they don't show us how they're coming up with this random base pay. So yeah, that is the video. Hopefully it made sense. I really tried my hardest guys, I promise. If you guys can, please share this with anyone that you guys know that is in the gig community. We're trying to get this out there because this is a problem and we should be paid fairly, especially with these crazy gas prices right now. It makes no sense that they're cutting us short on pay like this. Also something to mention, that order had zero dollars of gas assistance. So Where's that? Trust me, we're gonna have a whole video on the gas assistance thing coming up really soon. If you guys found this video helpful or just concerning like me, make sure you guys leave a comment down below. We can chat about it and things like that. Also, likes help get this video seen and we need to get this video seen so that this can get fixed. So I think you guys know what to do. Drop a like down below and I'll see you guys on the next video.